Hey guys, this is Tixta. And Metzger. And we are here to show you... Two alcoholic beverages. And the celebration of Friday, Friday the 13th. 13, a very superstitious holiday. Um, the first drink will be called Camp Crystal Lake Shot. Hope you guys enjoy it. Okay guys, the first ingredient is Smirnoff Vodka. It could be any vodka, but we picked Smirnoff. The second ingredient is Rum Chata. It gives that drink the white-ish color that we're going to give it. And then the last ingredient that we got is this cocktail artist syrup that we're going to use for the blue of the Crystal Lake. So the last couple things are a cup, a shot glass, and a measuring cup. And we'll show you how to do it. All right, guys, let's begin with rum chata. <laughs> rum chata. It's literally or chata with rum, and it's so delicious. I don't know if it's because I'm Mexican or an alcoholic, but it's so good. Um, anyways, you're going to pour it into the measuring cup, and it should be about 25 milliliters. And then you should pour it into the shot glass, and it's going to give you um, the quantity of half a shot. And then you're going to go ahead and top it off with vodka. And this depends on you, whether you want it sweet or stronger. You're going to add more or less vodka, okay? Then you're going to go ahead and grab the larger cup or glass. And then you're going to cover the shot glass in something with gravity or science or physics or something like that. You're going to cover it and then flip it over really quick. And you're not supposed to spill anything. Everything's supposed to stay in the shot glass. But we spilled. And it's okay. And then you're going to go ahead and grab the blue syrup. And then you're going to cover it with uh you're gonna cover part of the shot glass with the blue syrup just like that and it's gonna give it that like camp crystal lake feeling it's so beautiful then you're gonna go ahead and lift up lift up the shot glass and it's gonna give you that very like smoky like gloomy water and it's so beautiful and then that's it you're done you go ahead and drink it but make sure to get rid of the shot glass before you take a drink and don't follow his example. Um, and yep, that's it. It's called the Camp Crystal Lake Shot. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you. All right, guys, our next drink is called the Black Cat Cocktail. Fun fact, black cats aren't really bad luck. In Poland and Germany, if a cat walks across your path, it's good luck, actually. Another fun fact would be if you live in Japan and you're a single woman and you own a black cat, it's supposed to attract more male suitors. All right, let's get down to it. Okay, guys, the first thing you'll need is vodka. Again, it doesn't have to be Smirnoff. Uh, you will also need the Cocktail Artist Blue Caraco Syrup. I'm not sure how, if that's how you say it, but it'll, it'll be down in the description box. You'll need cranberry juice, and the reason why is the cranberry juice and the blue syrup will mix and make a beautiful purple effect. And then you'll need lemon lime soda and a glass, of course. Okay, guys, let's get to it. Our first ingredient is going to be syrup, some artist syrup, and it's going to be blue. That stuff is really, really sweet, so you got to make sure you don't pour too much of it. We're going to have 30 milliliters of it inside of this cup. Make sure you don't put way too much because if you do, your drink will be way too sweet. Our next ingredient is vodka. It smells kind of nasty, but you don't really taste too much of a difference if you're pouring it in for a drink. So you can put as much as you want in there. We put in 30 milliliters and that's what the recipe called for. So our next ingredient is going to be cranberry juice. Yes, you heard right. Cranberry juice, that delicious bitter drink. We're pouring it in there to make sure that it counter out, counterbalances the syrup that we put in there earlier. So that would be about 30 milliliters as well. We're going to pour that into the cup. Make sure it mixes up very well with the rest of the drink. And then our next ingredient is going to be lemon lime soda. It can be any type of lemon lime soda. It doesn't just have to be Sprite or 7-Up. It can be like a generic kind too and you put 30 milliliters of that one as well and we're pouring it into the cup and then it makes that nice purple color kind of turn a little bit lighter so you can see it and then our last ingredient is going to be lime juice and we put only 15 milliliters of lime juice because if you put way too much lime juice in 
it's going to taste absolutely horrible it'll taste exactly like limes and that would be it i guess it wouldn't be too bad if you like limonade <laughs> limonade but yeah that's it and then after that you're going to use a garnish of some lime pieces and that would be your drink This is me showing off the last drink and thank you so much for watching like and subscribe see you next time bye